Safety officers, listen up. Today, we're diving into the critical topic of confined spaces and the essential safety tips you need to know to keep your workplace safe and secure. Confined spaces are trickier than they seem. They present unique challenges and hazards that require special attention and preparation. Navigating through these tight spaces can be difficult and dangerous if proper precautions are not taken. Ready to master confined space safety? Let's get started by understanding what exactly constitutes a confined space and why it's so important to follow safety protocols. Understanding confined spaces is crucial for workplace safety. These areas can be found in various industries, from construction sites to manufacturing plants and even in some office buildings. Knowing how to identify and handle them can prevent accidents and save lives. A confined space has three main characteristics. First, it's large enough for a worker to enter and perform tasks. This means that the space is not just a small crevice, but a substantial area where work can be conducted. Second, it has limited or restricted entry and exit points. These points can be narrow or difficult to navigate, making it challenging for workers to enter and exit safely. And third, it's not designed to be occupied continuously by a worker. These spaces are not meant for long-term occupancy, and staying in them for extended periods can be hazardous. Before entering, atmospheric testing is essential. This step ensures that the air quality within the confined space is safe for breathing and free from harmful gases. Here's how we do it. First, evaluate the hazards in the permit space and verify acceptable conditions for entry. This involves a thorough assessment of potential risks and ensuring that all safety measures are in place. Start by testing for oxygen levels. Adequate oxygen is crucial for workers to breathe comfortably and avoid hypoxia, a condition caused by insufficient oxygen. Safe levels are crucial for breathing and avoiding hypoxia. The oxygen level should be between 19.5% and 23.5% to ensure a safe working environment. Next, check for combustible gases to prevent the risk of explosions or fires. Combustible gases can ignite easily, posing a significant threat to workers' safety. Finally, test for toxic gases and vapors that could harm workers. These substances can cause serious health issues, including respiratory problems and poisoning. Traditionally, separate instruments were used for each gas type, following a historical approach. This method, while effective, can be time-consuming and cumbersome. But today, modern gas detectors integrate multiple sensors into a single device, allowing simultaneous monitoring of various gases. This innovation makes the process more efficient and reliable. With proper atmospheric testing, we can ensure that confined spaces are safe for entry, protecting the health and lives of our workers. Remember, safety first. Always prioritize thorough testing and never cut corners when it comes to safety. Always perform thorough atmospheric testing before entering confined spaces. Stay safe and vigilant. By following these essential safety tips, you can help create a safer work environment for everyone involved. Let's work together to ensure that every worker returns home safely at the end of the day.